of all, guys, congratulations on Midnight Texas season one Thank recently you. premiered. Tell us about the journey so far, how you guys brought, got brought on to the project, and how it's been so far. Sure. So for me, it was kind of a surprise that this project came up. I, I was brought in like right before we started shooting, and as soon as I got in and met everybody, I just felt like I was at home. And actually, even before that, when I, when I saw the email about the project, I just felt like something clicked inside of me. And I was like, I want this. I think this is mine. And, and so I felt that way all the way through. There's just a feeling of home and family that has been a huge gift. Awesome. That's like the perfect way to get start a project. Amazing. Oh, absolutely. I mean, this has been a pretty seamless project for all of us, I think. Uh, same for me. I saw the material and knew I wanted it. And from the moment... I walked into that room, I was like, these people, we have been gifted with our workspace. We have amazing human beings, but also amazing creators, like amazing talents. And I, I don't really feel like, I mean, other than the, your practical things of time or weather or something, I don't think there's been a hiccup in our giddy. Response have you been getting back from people? Oh, such a fun response. I mean, we we spend a lot of time on Twitter. We've been live tweeting the show. It's been so exciting between that, like Facebook, doing Facebook Lives, and like just hearing back from people who were so invested either in the different actors from projects that they've been on, um, Charlene Harris, True Blood, um, you know, following like Monica Wusu, Brain, our showrunner. There's there's so many sci-fi fantasy folks that are involved that have been like waiting for something like this and that are so happy with it. It's incredibly fun to interact with them and actually be able to talk about stuff because it's not a spoiler anymore. You yes. know, like to be able to actually be like, yeah, wasn't that cool? It's a tiger. Like these kinds of things are, I'm having a great time because I'm a geek and I'm a fangirl. And so I'm on cloud nine. I love that. I love that you're so honest about being a fangirl because sometimes yeah. fangirls are put to shame and that's not okay. Only by jerks. Yeah. Yeah. Being a fangirl is the best. I think at this point in time we're kind of starting to figure out that geeks are the coolest people on the planet. Yeah. So be a geek. Nerd power. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. I love it. Well, thank you guys so much and thank congratulations you. on the show. Have an awesome time. Take thank care. You.